Hello everyone, it's Charlton, and they released uh, they released the body cam footage of the officer involved shooting in uh, Chicago, the south side of Chicago, I believe it is, and um, the person who was shot, Harith Augustus, and that's his uh, that's him pictured right there. I think he's a, a barber, you know, in the neighborhood. I think he's a father of five. I'm not absolutely sure. This all happened pretty quickly. The shooting took place. I, th I believe like Saturday early afternoon and within um, immediately I think a crowd started to build and protests erupted um, people throwing bottles climbing on top of patrol cars so um, you know I think an autopsy was done this morning initially uh, they were not going to with uh, uh, release the body cam footage but they did because I think of all the violent protests that happened so quickly which 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 caused uh, led to I think several arrests so the body cam footage is right here and they had said you know he he had a weapon was found on him but you see in this body cam um, you know it's clearly there in his waist I think it's a semi-automatic handgun I believe and, uh, and you see him go for it, you know, um, why he did this, I don't know, you know, cause there's cops all around him. He's completely surrounded. There's nothing he can do. Um, I don't know why he would do that, but he does, you know, and so then he's shot and killed. There's no audio to it anyways, so I'm not even going to, I'm just going to play it out. He has a clip there as well, as as well as the gun. And he's clearly going for it, man. You know, why he would do that? Because he's complete. there's nothing he can do. Um, I don't know. So, um... You know, uh, they like I said, they were going to wait. I don't know why before they release that for 30 days. There might even be a law on the books in Chicago. I think they do have that where they're not required to do it, and they um, they like to put some distance between the incident and you know releasing all the information, something like that. But they didn't. They released it today because of the protests that erupted right after it. I think a crowd built right away. People cha uh, chanting, you know. Um, things in the street and throwing bottles and uh, it says angry crowds um, you know confront police after fatal shooting of black men it happened like immediately afterwards you know so it can get you know that you know, when a crowd you know starts to build around it can get you know really scary fast and uh, so some people at the scene allege that a woman police officer shot Augustus at least five times in the back while he ran away, the Chicago Sun-Times reported. This is before, I think, the body cam, you know. The officer was taken from the scene in a police vehicle as the crowd began to form. Chicago Police Department spokes spokesman Anthony uh, Guglielmi Googly Googly discounted those reports. And that's, that's whose Twitter feed we're looking at when we're looking at the body cam there. And at the protest, the killing prompted an angry crowd of about 100 to linger at the scene for hours, chanting murderers and no justice, no peace. Some hurled rocks and bottles at police, resulting in several officers being hurt. According to the Chicago News Organization, others chanted, why do you serve? Who do you, who do you protect it? Uh, the tension escalated later in the evening as police advanced and tried to push protesters back from the scene, hitting at least six people with batons, prompting some protesters to uh, punch back at police. We just want to live, the Sun-Times quoted one woman protester saying. So, uh, but there's the body cam, and I think that pretty much clearly exonerates, you know. Um, that would be my layman's opinion. So, and he was, um, they were, they were, he was, they were, they were speaking with him because of the, they were suspicious that he had a weapon. They could see something protruding from his shirt. That's why they were, had stopped to talk to him, as I understand it. So that's it, man. That's the story there. I think that's my computer dying. 
All right, thanks for watching my videos. Please subscribe to my channel. Give me a like down below. I will see you in the next video. Later, man.